Hey everyone, you're with Tesla Tom. Thanks so much for joining us on Ludicrous Feed today. A beautiful sunny Sunday afternoon here in Sydney. Officially autumn, 3rd of March. Not quite hit the vernal equinox or autumnal equinox here in Sydney just yet, but the weather is cooling down slightly, particularly at night time, but we're still getting beautiful bright days here in Sydney. Autumn is officially my favourite season here in Australia, at least in Sydney, because we do get a lot of sun and the weather is not so hot as well. Let's have a look at my Powerwall 2 and my solar panels and how they performed here in uh, Sydney over the last month in February. Just keep in mind I've got a 3 kilowatt system uh, and uh, the panels produced 400 kilowatt hours of electricity in February. Um, and in terms of home usage, I used 395 kilowatt hours for the month of which 57.3% came from solar, 35.6% came from the Powerwall 2, and 7.1% came from the grid. So over 90% are powered from clean, renewable energy from the sun and also indirectly from the batteries. So pretty happy with those statistics. Um, and of that 400 kilowatt hours uh, from the sun, 56.5% went to the home, 42.2% went to the Powerwall 2, and only 1.2% went to the grid. Uh, the grid itself only used 67.8 kilowatt hours over the month, which is about just over 2 kilowatt hours per day. And I sent back 41.6 kilowatt hours back to the grid from the panels. And as you can see from this slide, my Powerwall 2 powered my house for 28 minutes on the 25th of February when power was down in my neighborhood. Um, on my neighborhood's Facebook page, there were people saying, where's the power? I've got no power but I couldn't help myself and I posted a video of my Powerwall 2 basically powering my house while it was being charged by the solar panels while the grid was out. So that was quite a nice feeling. Gloating I know, but look, I couldn't help myself, right? It's good to have that back up in case of that situation. And look guys, you just don't know in Australia, um, blackouts will apparently become more frequent, so it might be time to possibly think about having a battery for situations such as that. I know it wasn't a very long blackout, but hey, you just don't know, right? You just don't know what's around the corner. Never say never, okay? Alright guys, well that's probably my last report um, for my 3 kilowatt system. You guys might know that I'm going to be installing a 5 kilowatt system on top of the 3 kilowatt system I currently have, so making it 8 kilowatts altogether next week, so I'm very excited about that. Uh, if you haven't seen my video where I plan out my new 5 kilowatt installation, please have a look at that. I'll leave a link in uh, the card above here, so click on that, have a look. And guys, I just wanted to say a big thank you to everyone who supported Ludicrous Feed over the last 13 months. We finally reached 2,000 subscribers, so I'm very proud of that achievement. Thank you for all your help. Um, thank you for everyone who's appeared on this channel. Um, it's been a heck of a journey. I really enjoyed it, and there's heaps more content coming up in the next year and beyond. So thank you all again. Um, and guys, you know, keep watching. Um, I'll try to keep you up to date with the latest in renewable energy and also with regards to electric cars and batteries and all those kind of things. So keep watching. Thanks for supporting Ludicrous Feed. And I promise the new logo and merchandise, they are coming. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, happy charging. Thanks for watching and thanks for being part of the energy revolution. If you haven't done so already, be sure to hit subscribe to stay up to date with our latest videos. Happy charging!